welcome to another thrilling installment of What's Occurring. Roll intro. Body. Hopefully the sound should be good. And here we are in the new, improved, vape roomy, reviewy type place. <laughs> so we're back in the vape room. I need like a mascot, like um, like from the broom cupboard, didn't it? You know, <laughs> Gordon the Gopher. Mind you, we don't want Gordon. That's had Philip Schofield's hands up his ass. So yeah, it's all good. It's all good. So how are we all? Are we all good? Are we good? Are we good? Everyone good? Alright Neil, how are you doing bird? Nice to see you in the room. We have got some content in a bit because I've got... I haven't even opened the box of it yet. Mm, I'm looking forward to playing with that. Yes I am. So, yeah, in a bit, we've got the Swallowtail to have a look at. The Swallowtail 75A. Good, good, mate. Glad to hear it. Same here, I'm all good. Yes, content. We have content. Content we have got. Oh, yes, we have. Two seconds. Just spamming some linkages out. Some people in. Get in chat, everybody, because there's people watching that aren't in chat. So stop ghosting. Get in and say hello. Da, 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 da. What the fuck am I doing? Looking for someone to spam these up. There we are. Spam. Spam. Insta spam. There we go. Spam, spam, spam. Lovely spam. Good. Excellent. Brilliant. Yeah, the swallow tail. Well, the thing is, there is a pub in North Wales in Pemamau, right, that we used to go to for functions. Uh, me and a couple of mates. Uh, that she had, she had well, we had a few dues there, uh, Christmas dues. Um, she, my friend, ran a uh, mini owners club for the old classic minis, and we always used to have a thing. And the place was called the Spit. That sorry, the Split Wall. Split. Oh, I've got to get this fucking right now. It's called the Split Willow. So we used to call it the Spit and Swallow. <laughs> But yeah, what a name, what a name. But it does look an interesting bit kit. Alright, Owen Base, how you doing, bud? Just um, spamming some more linkies. So oh, yeah, it's all good. It's all good. <laughs> nice one, Neil. Nice one. Love it. Good, good. I've had some vape mail today. Funnily enough, today there's a nice chap called um, James. Oh, good name, obviously. Uh, on uh, one of the sites, it was the Ideal Home Show site. He was having trouble with his Minikin V2. Um, and a while back, he passed on a dripper to me, the um, Maelstrom by Lost Vape, because um, he, he wasn't using it. He only wanted it for the squonk bottles, so he passed it on to me. Anyway, he was having trouble with his mod, so I said, send it down to me. And he says, how much do you want for it? I says, just pay me the money to ship it back to you. That's all I want. So he sent it down. Anyway, he gave me, as a thank you, anyway... He sent it up, I fixed it today, there was a wire off in the board and there was some juice in it. So I've cleaned all that up, 
lovely jubbly, working fine, hunky dory, lovely purple minikin V2. Job. And he sent me a mod that he'd been given a while back to play with. A bit scruffy, it's a beta mod, but uh, it's a little 80 watt um, TNT 80 watt. Takes a 26650, so I need to get a 26650 and have a play with that. But he sent me that, so I got that. Very nice of him, nice chap, lovely guy. Um, and when I can find out where the hell, I got a bit of a Billy Bargain from Esig Aspire. Uh, Aspire Esig, let me find them. UK Aspire, there we go. Aspire UK. Da ba da ba da. Because I, I like my old gear, I like a bit of the old school stuff, you know, a little bit of the mouth to lungy stuff, the old school shizzle. Um, and. Esig Aspire UK Aspire UK are selling off stuff cheap. So there we go. Check this out, guys. There you go. So I got that. I got old school vapage. Oh yes, I did. And why isn't my autofocus working? Probably because I haven't got autofocus turned on like a penis. No, I have got autofocus turned on. It's just having a moment. I got the old iTaste 134. Oh yeah, focus you bastard. It's because there's other things in the background. Now focus. There we go. There we are. Hunky dory. Job's good. Nothing wrong with the older gear. I like the older gear. Yeah, the mini. With the, um, it's got the 18, it's in 18350 mode at the minute because I haven't got any 18500s. But good news is they've got some um, other stuff um, on there that's from Inikin. They've got the same style mod, but they did a mech version. There's an MG and an MZ one. Uh, the MG is 12.99 and the MZ is 14.99. And if you use the discount code provided to good, good old uh, Mr. Victor himself. Um, you'll get 15% uh, off. So it's VIC in capitals. VIC. 15 in letters. Uh, 15 in numbers, sorry. And that'll give you 15 off, which means you get that for 16.99 delivered. Unless you want to pay extra postage, in which case it'll be 20 quid with the postage. With the discount code. Yeah, I know I need more light on me, mate. Um, unfortunately... I have got a very nice lighting unit, but can I find the adapter to put it on my um, thing? No. Okay, I'll show you actually, because I'm sure you guys are interested to see what shit I use. I've got a big light up there, which currently, because it's a bit harsh, um, the light's a bit harsh because it's not got a, a diffuser on it. It's currently got kitchen roll on the front of it as a diffuser. So that's not going to do. So when I get round to it, I've got this. Now you might think, what the fuck's that shit? Well, that is a photography brolly because I have got this beautifully made old bit of kit. This is knocking on for 40 years old and it's still rocking and rolling, wheeling and dealing. It's fine. All good. All good. It's going to be too bright, that. It's not. <laughs> yeah, it is. It's not. But there we go. My light's fine. I've even given myself a tan look. I've tinted. I've got a tan. I look like I've got a tan on. I've got tan on. Yes. Morning. Yeah. So this, this, this bad boy, this bad boy here, has got a flash in it. I'm not going to use the flash, but I'm going to change the bulb that's in there because that's a very expensive bulb. Those bulbs are like 40 quid each. Oh, no. No, it doesn't like that. It doesn't like that at all. Do that again. Do it again. Yeah. 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 Look like I'm on fire. Look like I've got an 18650 fucking vent in front of me. But yeah, that'll be set up at some point. Um, the light will change in a minute. As soon as it starts going a bit darker, the light will change again because obviously I've got the daylight coming through the door. So it'll sl you'll see the light will slightly change slightly. But, uh, yeah, it does look like the same one, Walking Dead. Yeah, my camera didn't like that at all. 
It's a good cow. It's good. It's good light. That is. It's a good lamp. Yeah. Look. This. This is what I was just using then. These are great. Was it from Lidl? Lidl Aldi's. One of the two. It was like a five or something. Yeah. Five ninety nine or four ninety nine, wasn't it? Bit of a Billy bargain. Bit of a Billy bargain. I see no ships. But yeah, good bit of kit that if you want just a bit of extra light on stuff when you're working on stuff. Cheers, Maffy. Yeah, I've had this paper up a while. Like I bought it from the other house, but of course we moved down here, so so it was a bit trimmed. So there was a bit left over because it was a lot bigger because obviously I'd measured it for a different wall. Um, so the bit that's left over went on the back of the door. I have got some lights to go underneath my shelf at some point. I've got some strips to go underneath there. Well, technically they're not strips. They're um, well, they will be when I've attached them. They're actually off an old kit that used to go underneath the car. You know, you'd have like the four tubes and the ground light kit when you're like, ah, yeah, boy, yeah, ground light kit. So it's one of them. Um, but I need to cut it down. No, the lid's not in here. She's just bugged off. I've seen a bit. It's a bit. Yeah, but yeah. Do you know something? I was actually going to put a sign on there. I was going to make a little sign. The shelf is fucking level. Do you want proof? Do you want proof it's level? Before you all fucking start. There you go. Perfect. Job done. The shelf's level. The problem is, there's so much weight in this room, because it's such a little room, and the floors are shit. Yeah, I set everything up. I leveled all my desks up. The desks were all leveled horizontally, vertically, everything. Set it all up, bob on. Got it leveled. Next day, came to it. I even put the spirit level on my fucking monitor so my camera was straight. Don't blame the spirit level. That's the best Poundland fucking offers. I know it's level because I checked it with another level. But on another level. <laughs> Surprised Bunny's not in here yet. Where's Bunny at? She'll be all over this shit. Welsh Poundland deals, yeah. I know they've made me paranoid. Because the thing is, though, I'm really, 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 really fussy with stuff normally. Yeah? And unless it's right, it won't do. Um, I mean, for instance, I bought these fucking speakers that you see behind me here, right? 14 or 15 years ago, maybe more. Maybe even more. They're Logitech X530. Yeah, X530s. Um, and they were very expensive back in the day, and I got them on a deal. And this is the first time that they've been set up correctly. I've got now got full Dolby surround sound. Because so I got them plugged into a decoder in the computer. Hmm. Oh, what else have I got coming? Uh, oh, yeah. I have got um, a new webcam. My mate Matthew, fucking legend he is. Absolute legend. I'm doing his wedding photos for him. Um in April time, um, something like that, um, so yeah, I'm doing that at some point, so we wanted um, stuff, so anyway, he, he was sort of like, oh, we were talking about stuff, and what I was like, you know, and what camera I was using, that, he bought me another one, so I'll have a clo proper closey uppy cam, so I don't have to keep moving this one, and what have you like, so yeah, it's all good. So what do we know, peeps? Why is everyone watching going? Come back, you bunch of bastards. Right, what's going on here? Why is this running like shit? That is the first time I've had drop frames. Oh, yeah. That will be the stepdaughter. Downloading. Or streaming. Yeah. Yeah. Most likely.
But yeah, it's all good fun. My stream dropped out. Why the fuck's my stream dropped out? It's never done that before. Have I got stuff running that I shouldn't have? Got stuff running that I shouldn't have? Not changed anything whatsoever. Yeah, it just had a squiffy fit for some reason. Never, do you know, not once have I had, I haven't got any porn on, don't be silly. Not once have I had any drop stream rates at all. It has just come up that I've just dropped 600 frames, but that's only 600 out of 29,200, so it's all right. Might go and, I need to wash a dripper out in a minute anyway. Need to wash your dripper out and um, chisel. Hmm. Turn off your pawn! Turn off your pawn! Yeah, so I'm going to have to um, go and clean a dripper up because I'm going to have to put something on this swallowtail when I test it in a minute, aren't I? And we'll have a little first looky at it. Yeah. Wait for some more peeps to come in first. I shall be right back in a sec, guys. I shall be back in a sec. Oh, yes. See, see the lights fading now. It's getting better. There, it's good. That's all right. That's all right. That's all right. I, might, I can always up the, uh, let's up the lighting on that. And I should be back in a second. Let just let the uh, dripper, 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 dripper. Just bring up the brightness slightly, tiny, tiny tad bit. A little bit more gain, maybe. Bit more gain. Is that better, peeps? Drop the colour intensity so I don't look like David Dickinson anymore. There we go. That's better. That's better. Right, guys. So I'll be back in a second, all right? We're going to clean this dripper out and then we'll have a little look-see, okay? Back in a sec.
and I'm back. There we go. I'm back, people. I'm back. I'm back. <coughs> Pardon me. Outputs. Sources. Webcam. Logitech. And we're back in the room. There we go. There we are. And I'm back, people. Open that up a little bit more. There we go. Liney, liney. Lovely, jubbly. Oh, that's bright. What's happened to that contrast? That's better. There we go. That's better. That's better. That's better. Yeah, so I need to do a build. Now, I need to find all my shit because I don't know where my shit is. Have I got any coils lying around on here that I can make use of? This fucker. They might do. Yeah. Nope, that won't go in there. Have I got any coils here? I've got a coil I can make use of. No, that's too big. Well, that'll do. I'll use that fucker. Yeah, that'll go in there, I think. That'll go in there. Just pull that off there. Cheers, no frills. Yeah, I've had it for a while, mate. It's, it's cracking stuff. It's one of these wall mural things. It's all spacey and stuff. Um, it's on eBay, it is. Um, I'll show it you if you want. It, it wasn't mega dear. It's quite smart. Comes in like A1 sheets. Galaxy warm mural. Images. Galaxy warm mural. Not that one. Yeah, that's the fucker. Visit page. What does it call it? Galaxy Wall Mural, I'm sure it is. Galaxy Wallpaper. Mural Galaxy Wallpaper. That's it, that's the fucker. I got mine ridiculously cheap because it was sort of like on a bidding thing. Um, I've just got to find the right one because there's loads of them. Um, I like this one, this one's cool as fuck. Don't even know if this one's still available. There it is. That's the fucker. There you go, guys. There's the link if you find if you want that. The buffering. Why are you buffering? Why is it dropping streams? Karika, any um, advice? Why I'm dropping streams? The fuck's going down with this now? Hang on, guys. Let me stop it and start again. I'll be back in a second. Hang on. Fucking tech issues. See if it works better now. Should do. We're working better now. And we're back. There we go. There's the link to the wallpaper I've got anyway. Ah, lovely. Yeah, let's see if we can get this fucking coil in here. We might be able to. Should fit in there. Well, maybe I can do that with it. Straight through the middle. Just do it. Space coils for the win. Oh yeah. Space coils. Pigs in space. <laughs> right, let's get the fucking coiler kit out. So I haven't sorted everything out yet in here because it's still uh, all new and what have you. No drop frames this time. Should be a bit better now. What size was that? 3mm is it? 3mm was it? Yeah, it's a 3mm. 3 mil. Where's my cutters? My cutters are here somewhere. I just pushed them over a minute ago because I had them here and they were in the way. The fuck have I done with them now? Right down there. What's going on? If you need anything? Right. Let's get the camera on the closey camera a bit, shall we? Let's get the camera on closey cam. Right, closey cam.
camera closey closey uppy. There we are, that's better. Oh, this fucking thing does not like fucking uh, balancing. There we go. There we are. There we are. Closely up you can. There we are. Closely up you can. There we go. That's better. Right, Philip, how you going, bird? Uh, focus on that. Where is my cutters? Nope, they're Tunnix tea cakes. It's because I've lobbed everything over here a minute ago before I came on air. I just lobbed everything out of the way. <laughs> oh, there they are. They fell on the floor. <laughs> <coughs> Pardon me. This was a parallel thing that I did. I don't like parallel birds. They're a bit silly. So we'll just do a spaced uh, cut instead, shall we? Take that. There we go, spaced evenly ish. Space, the final frontier. Right, I need my buildy fucking boxy thing. Buildy boxy thing. There. Where's a battery? Where's my battery gone? Oh, for fuck's sake, I keep putting things down. I'm terrible for putting things down. Oh, I know it. It's because they're in my work bag. <laughs> That's why I can't find the fucking things. I'll have a battery out of that, shall we? Yeah. Why the hell not? Let's have a bash. Let's have a bit of fucking bash. Let's have a fucking bit of a bash. There we go. Let's get some more um, focus on the go here. The focus in. There we are. Get a bit more light on the subject. Where's the light thing? There we are. There's a bit more light on the subject. Doobie do, a bit more light on the subject. That can fuck off down there. That can go there. I've got not got any drop streams yet, so that's alright. Just knock the brightness up a little bit maybe. Give it a bit more gain. There we go, that's a bit better, isn't it guys? Yeah? That's better. There we are. Let's get this in here. battery out and didn't put it in there. <laughs> oh, well prepared as usual, guys. Well prepared. Oi, oh, yo, Tony, yo, yo, yo. Mum, there we go. Lovely, jubbly, lovely, jubbly, lovely, jubbly. Get that in there. We need the three mil bit, which is that one. Three mil bit, which is that one. We need the three mil top for that one. Now we should need the thing jig. Awkward bastard. Yeah. I need a bigger desk. <laughs> Spaced coils for the win. There you go. Space coil. Let's make sure that is spaced evenly ish. Little dingy dingy doodle doodles. That's pretty de near as damn it that is. I don't think it gets any much better than that. Just pull a little bit off that, I think. Go. Do that, and then that one at the bottom can get bent round there. Back on auto focus, it might fucking focus a bit better. Oh, focus. It's not happy my camera today. Focus, you bastard. Doesn't like being focused. There we go. It's better. Do nicely, nicely, nicely. Bend that, that way a little tiny bit. Bend that one. Make sure that's nice and flat. Bend that one that way a little bit. That way a little bit, and that way a little bit. 
And then that one can go that way a little bit. And that is pretty much bob on. And screws open. Get those screws open. Lovely jumper. Why is that bent? Don't know why that's fucking bent. I don't fucking know. Fucking bent for some reason. It's gone all dirty on me. Right, where is my screwdriver? Destiny! No screwdriver of destiny. <laughs> Bag puss. Fucking hell. Knit that up. Two. A little tweeze. Space coils for the way there. They spaced evenly, evenish. Be nice and even now. Snip that off. This is probably going to come out ridiculously low, isn't it? If you can see that, guys, get the focus up nice and high on that. There you go. <coughs> nice little space job. Right, Big Tom, you sexy fucking hairy bastard. How the devil are we? A little gentle pulse fire, because it is a spaced one and they don't like being pulsed very much. Oh, nice and nice and pulsy and pulsy pulsy. Yeah. My focus is not having fucking the best of days today at all. Nicely, nicely. Can't beat a gentle pulse. Bit of gentle pulsing. Never hurt anyone. Space coils. There we are. Lovely jubbly, lovely jubbly, lovely jubbly. There we are. We're nice and burnt in now. Get that nice and close so you guys can see. Oh, look at that. Nice and nicely. Nicely, nicely. There we are. Focus, you bastard. Come on. It's the point where I put my hands on the coil and fucking burn me fucking up, burn me fucking hands. There we go. It should be nicely, nicely that. Hopefully that won't touch the outside of there. Just don't think it does. We can open the drip tip and have a little peek through there, make sure. I'm guessing that would be Rick. Hello Rick, how are you? But then again, we all know fancy coils make no fucking difference anyway, do they? No, I quite I, I quite like them. No, well, I'll tell you exactly what happened was. I made a parallel. Didn't like the parallel, so I've reused the coils. What's wrong with that? A little bit of dirty cotton. Them pre-bends, though. Dem, it's all about that pre-bends. You know it, bitches. Them pre-bends, though. So as soon as I've built this, we'll have a little look at the uh, Segeli Swallowtail, shall we? Why the hell not? That's what I say. Why the hell not? Don't be dissing Stu because he's not here to defend himself. <laughs> Things never fucking change. 
I think we've got a thunderstorm on the way, guys and girls. From the sounds of it. Either that, someone's got some serious digestion issues. Okay, it's not Rick. I'm not too nice to fucking push him. I think the chat's a little bit behind for some reason. There's something rather nice when you when you first do the bow ties, though, isn't it? You do the old bow ties. My camera's not having any of it today. It's really not a happy bunny. There we are. Okay. I'll give these some tuckages. Some tuckages. And we need the tucky tweezers that are vicious as fuck, which are these fuckers from the old coil master kit. Fucking how many of you have you stabbed yourself with these fucking things? They're vicious. So yeah, we get that in there nice and nicely. Yeah, I thought we had a bit of thunder. So that may mean that the show might be cut short because we have a power cut, but there's only a little one at the minute, so that's what she said. Nicely tuck that in there underneath there. Boom, like that. Saucy, saucy monkey. It's been hurry it up. <laughs> You're all wanting to see this swallowtail, aren't you? You're all itching to see this fucking swallowtail. Well, every, every man and his dog had the fucking chaos, and no one's got one of these fuckers, so it's all good. Juice. And today, I will be mostly vaping on this. Let's juice this motherfucker up. Oh, what did we come out with? 0.44 ohms. Perfect. My favourite, no, one of my favourite, I like 0 0.4, 0 0.5 builds. Get that all moistened up. There we are. Ooh, you can't beat a bit of moist Clapton's, can you? Hey. Eh? Should be ready to rock and roll that now. Just give that a quick fire. See what that's like. Burn the excess juice off. <laughs> Moist. Flavour. Mmm. Flavour for days, bro. Flavour for days. It's all about the flavour, sweetheart. Mmm. It's alright, it's a big bottle, Jamie. It's fine. And you shouldn't worry about wasting juice. You fucking make your own, so stop moaning. that nobody likes going in dry <coughs> no spitty spoilies <laughs> who's fucking a pasty yeah don't worry Tom I'm fluffing for you guys I'm fluffing for you guys it's fine Just keeping them all amused before they go and make food. Are you drawing that competition tonight or what? <laughs> Three weeks they've been waiting <laughs> for you to draw it. 
Roll over. Reset that on the single airflow because it don't need that much airflow. Bam in there. Bing bang bosh. Oosh, jobs are good. Mm, dirty bastard. That is ready for to go on the Sigeli. That is fucking ugly. Honestly, can't keep up with you guys. Oh, old school vape. Right, should we have a look at this swallow tail then, you bunch of bastards? Come on then, let's have a look. So, provided by the lovely, um, my friends at Deluxe Vapors. They give me one of these for review. Oh yeah, I'll have a little look round the boxy boxy, very shiny shiny. Usual Chinese fodder and a bit of waffling on the end. What does he say there? Sigali swallowtail, blah blah blah. Specifications I can't read. Yeah. Get in there slowly, dude. Get in there slowly. Boxy, boxy. Openy, openy. Blah, 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 blah. Ooh, that's naughty. Yeah, I know it is. But you'll probably end up getting it at Expo because I'm tight with fucking postage. <laughs> and I'd rather give it to you personally anyway. Click your buttons. Little lucky round here. It's quite nicely finished actually to be fair. It looks quite tidy. It's got smiley faith on it. A blinkly smiley face. It is actually quite nicely made. There's a few gaps on it, but the, the some of the colours in it and I mean look at that. I, the way it catches the light's quite snazzy. I quite like it. Well, it's definitely different. You know, they put a bit of thought through it. You know, it's not like a metal tube that you just stick a switch on the bottom, is it really? It's a little bit more of a look to it. I'm, I'm not a big fan of the this sort of like painted coppery effect. Personally, I'd rather the silver. But it's quite, it, it does match. It does. It does um, sort of like match what's what's there, like you know. Build quality seems quite nice. A nice, nice feel in the hand, like holds nice in the hand, like that. We put a battery in it, shall we? I suppose we better look at the specs actually on the bottom first. Where's the spec sheet? Uh, ten to seventy-seven watts wattage range. It's an odd number, isn't it? I thought it was 75. Never mind. Uh, 3.2 volts to 4.2 volts input range. Output voltage 1 to 7.5 volts. Resistance range 0.1 ohms to 3 ohms. Operation mode power stainless steel TI NI200 TCR TFR. Temperature range 100 degrees C to 300 degrees C. 212 Fahrenheit to 572 Fahrenheit. Mm. Very nice. It's not actually that big, you know. Um, it's quite nice, actually. If you hold it in your hand like that, or that, it's quite nice. It's quite comfortable. Yeah, 77. Yeah, got to keep the matchy-matchy. 
this the plastic bit on the bottom's a bit sharp. Bear in mind, guys, these are eighty quid. Oh yeah. Hmm. Let's get a battery in there, shall we? Battery. Right, lesbian, how are we, dude? Are we good? I presume it goes positive in first. Soon find out. Oh, it's fired up. It did something. Well, that was good. Oh, there we go. Sigeli. Let's turn that down so you can see it. Turn the gain down in it. Screen's quite nice on it. Hmm. There's a nice display on it. Yeah, nice display on it. Check out the miser. Two, three. Well, it goes through the um, the numbers quite quickly. It's quite nice. Hey up, GBV. All right, stop moaning about fucking lighting. Do you want to go off on lighting or what, London? Eh, uh, lesbian. Go off on it because you don't need a fucking you don't need two soft boxes, do you? Do you want to go off on a pair of soft boxes? It's only because I've changed rooms, that's all it is. A bit more juice in there, I think. Hair care products? I don't have any fucking hair. Take it down to go for forty watts, shall we? Let's try it at forty watts. <sighs> Fuck me, that was some lightning and half, I tell you. There's some serious lightning going off here, guys. I'll go back up top cam, I think. Fuck it. It's because I moved the fucking camera now, isn't it? Me, you fucking thing. I'll be so glad when I get my other camera, because then I'm going to have to move the camera every five fucking minutes. There we are. There we go. And we're back. Take it down to 30 watts then. See, it's not that big. Bulbous, it's quite comfortable. It's quite nice. <coughs> Pardon me. It's getting a bit dry, that. A bit harsh. But yeah, it's quite pretty. It's definitely nice. I like it. There are different colours as well available. But yeah, it's a nice bit of kit. Mind you, this coil's got a bed in as well, hasn't it? So.
talk after if you want less if you want to go off on some lighting because all I need is one big fucking softbox that's all I need in here is a softbox Well, first impressions, it's quite nice. Although, I have to say, I don't know whether it's because my battery might be a bit iffy. The battery level meter is jumping like a bastard when you're vaping on it. But then again, that might be my... Um... Oh, the, the mode's easy enough to change. Three clicks for mode. Three clicks for mode. It's easy enough to use. Same chip that they've used in everything else, I think. Oh, is there a GoFundMe? Everybody go to Les's GoFundMe so we can uh, keep reviewing. <laughs> Cheers, Philip. Yeah, I like it. It looks smart. Yeah, GP alternative. But what happened there? Don't want to fucking happen there. I know what happened there. There we are. It's better. <coughs> oh, fuck off. Lesbian. Disgraceful. Turn that brightness down a little bit. It's fucking doing my head in. It's a bit too bright, bright, if you know what I mean. That's better. A bit better. Yeah, it's definitely worse to go and see a doctor. Callie is a nice one. <laughs> Ooh, meow. Disgraceful. Someone got the itch? What itch? It's not really Pepsi in here, it's fucking whiskey. Just empty cans I keep topping up. So yeah, I quite like this little mod, it's quite tidy. Finish is nice on it. Some of the edges could be a bit smoother, but then again it is mass produced, so you don't expect it to be fantastic. Come on, you're after all the tokens and then segments for those with the glass has got a factor also that you fix the camera to chat and use for me. Second worst. Who could you possibly be on about? No idea. Okay, I've picked him to the post. Honestly, people, disgraceful. Better open a window. Let's get a bit of vaporoony in here. Yeah. 
I'm waiting for him to come in in a minute and start moaning. Oh yeah, how is Jessica doing on her uh, fundraising thing? Are we still got, are we still going? Are we still doing well? How are we doing? Oh, we've got, we've hit over. Oh, well, that's good. Let's get some more in there, guys. Get her some spending money, so she can buy some more Disney stuff. Disney for the win. Yeah, cracking job that is. Well done, everybody that's put money into that. Well done, well done. Right, come on, peeps. There's 23 watching and about 7 in chat, so get in. Join in. Join the fun. Yeah, sorry I had to pop off, guys, and do some shizzle, but... I had just got home from the shop when like 10 minutes before so I didn't have much prep time so I had to go and fucking wash that out ready oh yeah it's all good it's all good Let's see if we can cram a battery in this fucking TNT mod shall we oh fuck it's a 26650 mod but I may be able to make it fit and work because it's the same length after all isn't it it's all about the length mmm Dirty bastard. If I can get it just to work, see if it works, it'd be fucking good, wouldn't it? Which way up? Posy that end? Yeah, posy that end. Posy that end. Oh, it does work. Ooh. Check out a miser. Well, it does work, guys. Look. There we go. Did get some 26650s now. And I might, I might even take it apart and dip it. Because that'll look nice dipped. Don't know what, but I'll dip it. I'll rub it back and dip it. Be funky. Or paint it. Might just paint it. Yeah, paint it. Be cool. I'll do something with it. I'll do something cool with it. Because it's quite a nice mod. It's not going in there now. Fucking thing won't fit. Okie dokie. Bebop, meh. I think the parrot stuff's overpriced. They're overpriced toys, the parrot. And stuff like that. What's the next mod I want to buy? Um, I want to get myself a Stabwood one, to be honest. Um, if I've got enough money at Expo, that's my main purchase at Expo, is I want a Stabwood mod. That's what my next mod's going to be. I need something Stabby Wood. I just need something Stabwood. Because I've got all this stuff, and it'd be nice to have something a little bit higher end. Which Tesla, mate? I do quite fancy that mech box um, from, um, who is it, fucking Vape Geek. I do quite fancy that. I do like the look of that. Because I do like me mechs. So maybe that and a stab wood and I'm done for a while. Um, maybe a few tanks. So I know I want a Gaia one. Yeah, that one's gorgeous. I'm all over that shit, mate. 
all over that shit. Well all over that shit. I like that. I like that a lot. I like it a lot. Yeah, that needs to go in there. I need to glue that magnet back in on that. But that seems to be working. Just need to get some 26650 batteries. Batteries. Yeah, I do quite fancy one of those. Mind you, I like Tesla stuff. Oh, <coughs> update. You know the uh, Tesla touch? Bomb proof. When I was putting the shelf up, I put this shelf in, you know, I had to put a drill hole in the top. I dropped that and it went. Pfft. Not the steampunk one, you can. Oh, yeah, I want the steampunk one. Mmm, yes. Steampunk for the win. Steampunk is all over me, mate. Steampunk, I love the steampunk. Steampunk, that is. Nothing else. <laughs> yeah, the Tesla three is a cracking little bit of bit of kit. I love Tesla stuff. A bit like a brick. Yeah, anyway, as I was saying, I dropped my hammer. Now, where have I put my fucking hammer? Yeah, if I had a hammer. I've got a big claw hammer. And I dropped it off the top shelf. And it landed on this shelf. Clean on that fucking Tesla. Landed on the screen. And the screen's still fine. Yeah, I love that steampunk one. It's fucking nice. For me, though, I don't like the twacky copper, but I like the one on the far right. Far right's my favourite. That's my fave. But yeah, they are quite full. But I, I do plan. It's something I've been thinking to do for a while. I, I am planning on making a wooden mod that has a window in it. And it's got a load of clock wheels or watch parts, and when you fire it, they turn. Yeah, but it's not copper, Les. It's that pretend copper. They've plated it to make it look. It's like them cheap lighters you used to get on the markets. Yeah, I like the far right myself. That's the one I fancy. I'm not doing it again, you can fuck off. But as a one off, yeah. It still works. <laughs> Alright, Hercene, how are we doing, bird? Yeah, you could dry brush it, yeah. Yeah, you could put like green patina and stuff on it, couldn't you? You could paint it up and make it look really smart. Yeah. Make it look really smart though. Good, good man. Good, good. Glad to hear it. Yes. So, new stuff. Not really seen anything new. It's been fucking shit. Been shit with new stuff. Has anyone bought anything? Waiting for some vape mail? Anyone vaping for stuff? Waiting for stuff? Alright, Bunny. Bunny, look. Look what he's got, Bunny. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
<laughs> How much are 15,000 subscribers anyway, Les? Sod's low, that is. How much are they on fast tech? Hey, I've seen you well too late. Everyone's done all these fucking jokes already. Bargain. Cool. So Trench is going to be on earlier, an hour early. He's coming on at nine o'clock. I think it's only right. I put all uh, I put the Lux Vapors website on here. They haven't got everything on their website yet because they're still building it. But have a look at their mods. Mods. See what they got on there. Got anything on there? They ain't got much on there. They got a couple on there. Have a little look, guys. It's only fair I spam them out because you know they were good enough to give me this uh, mod. So there we go. Yeah, I like the look of that Q box, Philip. Yeah, I quite fancy the rainbow. I like the purple too. Doobie doo doo. Doobie doo doo doo. Yeah, I do like the key box. I quite fancy one of those. I do, I do really like, like fancy one of them. And plus, it'd be nice to have some hardware for a change because all I've done recently is fucking juice review, juice review, juice review, juice review. So I love this. <laughs> Although it looks quite chunky, it's quite comfortable in the hand because it's curvy. It's very um, tactile. Oh, £29.87. Oh, that's alright. 30 quid. I would say the Tesla Touch has been faultless, really. Been a cracking bit of kit. Cracking bit of kit. Cracking bit of kit. Just need more wattage and more airflow, by any chance, probably. Hey, nobody needs more, but sometimes they just want a couple. Spanking is fine, but keep the keys close. Don't call nine nine nine. What was it on the fucking iPhone? Isn't it fucking? Is it one oh eight or something like that? Don't fucking ask Siri to do one oh eight or something like that. Oh, got a refresh, I've crashed.
17. What happened then? Conway Empire Vape Co is to go to buy for smock reviews. First roll of squonker, remember to squonk the damn bottle before hitting the fire, but yes, Les. How are you enjoying the rice by any chance, mate? You, is it good? Are you enjoying it? I do like a good squonk. I've got a couple. Kind of a little bit of addictive. <laughs> no. Nice one, mate. Yeah, I, I enjoy me squonking. And I fucking love this thing to death. This little halluscene. I fucking love it to death. Needs rebuilding and rewicking. <laughs> Should we rewick it now? Fuck all else to do. Should we have a look? You want to watch me re-wick that fucker? With the Hadley clone on it? Yeah, fuck it. Let's re-wick it. Let's re-wick this motherfucker. Go down to close here, Picam. Zoomy, zoomy. Ignore the mess. Ignore the mess. Ignore the mess. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Some focus on it. more brightness a bit more gain on there get a bit more colour in the go there we go I'll do let's re-wick this fucker then shall we goodbye old Maggie Cotton goodbye in the bin it goes burn that fucker off hi Stu I'll cool down. Yeah, where is Gwen? We haven't seen Gwen for a while. Yeah, C920 um, thing. My mate Matthew has been very, very nice and he's bought me a second C920. <coughs> so I'll have the tripod set up on by the side of me with a sheet of paper and I'll have a proper close yuppie cam. And it'll look sweet, isn't it? And then I can just swap frames and I won't have to keep flipping up and down and what have you and fannying about. I'll have a specific area for doing builds, which will be cool as fuck and close-ups and stuff like that. Make it a little bit more pro, my videos pro. So that should be here in a couple of days. Do-do-do-do, bit of cotton. Bit of cotton, there's a bit of cotton. I do need to clean this mat, it does need to go in the wash. Or I need to get another one. So if anyone has any vape mats... Plus she's not a, uh, yeah. A little bit too much cotton there, guys.
you know, overdid the cotton on that a little bit. Do. Yeah, briber with Jaffa cakes. <laughs> Do like Jaffa cakes. Jaffa cakes are amazing. They're like the best thing ever. Although they shouldn't be called cakes, really, should they? Because they're not really a cake. Can't even remember what's in there. Oh, it's that. I've got that in there. <laughs> Hashtag Jaffa cake. Oh, we ain't got long to go now. We go go back up top again. Here we are. Zoom me out. Zoom me out. There we go. That's all fucking done for tomorrow. Just got me bit ready for tomorrow now. Yeah, technically they're not a biscuit, really, are they? Let's face it, they're not a biscuit. It's not a biscuit at all. I've got my eye on something else. It's not technically it is vape related, but I'll put a little screen up shot up. Um, see what you think, guys think. Oh, I'm just fucking waffling shit mainly, aren't I? I have got my eye on something else. Um, let's get a picture of that up. That's a good picture. There we go. View image. Put that on screen share. Get that on screen share. Make it smaller. Should be able to make it smaller somehow. Put on screen share, and you can all see it. This is something I've got my eye on. Um, mainly because I'm a big tart and I like gadgets. But um, there we are. Put that up there in the top left. Put it in there. Put it in the top left there. Up there. Put it there. Look. Ah, there we go. This bad boy. I've got my eye on one of these. Now, for you people that aren't gadgety, that is basically a little preamplifier for my microphone. So at the minute, it's just going straight into my computer. Uh, but because it's a condenser mic, effectively a studio microphone, it needs what they call phantom power, which is plus 48 volts. Um, and that does it. But that's even better with that is it's got, a, it's got a valve in it, so you get a bit of sound. And you can change the sound on it, so you can have like a warm. You can set it for like an old school sound and all sorts of stuff. But yeah, it looks it looks a nice bit of kit, and they're not mega dear. It's about forty quid. I missed out on one the other night on Facebook on on uh, eBay. I was fucking gutted. I just missed out on it by a pound. Went for twenty quid because it wanted um, it had crackly um, output sockets on it, so it just not it needed new sockets. And so about forty fifty quid, forty to forty five pound delivered new. But it means my microphone will sound better. Um, I'll have a lot more control. Um, I can put the microphone farther away, get better sound on it, you know. 
Yeah, I'm not sure expensive for them. I found them. Um, I think it was Gak had them. It was Gak UK, I think. Was it Gak that had it? Yeah, it was Gak that had it. MIC 200. Wait, loads. 45 quid. You can also plug your guitars in it. Yeah, I've seen the, the uh, 100, but I want, I want to go full balls deep, like... The 100 hasn't got these special effects on it. But yeah. So I'm going to get one out at some point. Have a play with that. It's got all sorts of different modes. You can make it sound cool and all sorts of stuff. Yeah, you see that third knob it had on it? It's got settings for different sounds. Andertons? Oh, don't let me near, near on that shot. Oh, shit. They haven't got one. Just have a look now. Got some nice stuff on there. Mesa boogies. I can have one of those. Mm. I'll cry if I go on there. Some very nice stuff on there. Mm. Exactly. Exactly, Stu. Looks like a nice bit of kit. Maybe I should start crowdfunding. If everybody puts a quid in, I'll be able to get one. Try meeting skills. I'm hungry. Yeah, hashtag make Jay's voice for me. That's the way. That's the way. Yeah, I feel the warmth from my farts. You'll be able to have a surround sound experience, yeah. Taste the rainbow, see the rainbow, hear the rainbow. <laughs> it's all good. Alright, come on then, guys. Fuck it, let's have a QA session. Find me some questions. Find me some questionies. Kevin the Bird, um, otherwise known as Lou, has gone back with his mum because they've got a house down this way now, so they've gone to stay there. No, Stu, not yet. I haven't bought any yet. I do need to because the um, the Purple Beast's nearly um, finished.
unicorn mod. Um, that kind of goes with her scene. Um, there's not really a unicorn mod, but I've got um, quite a few of them. Um, anything that's high end and fucking really pretty, stab woody railing more than anything else. I'd love a limelight. I'd love a limelight from limelight mechanic, something like that, one of the limelight boxes. Nice. Yeah, I like that stuff, it's pretty cool. Do I agree with the TPD? Technically, yes. I mean, they're not doing it the right way. They're not particularly doing a good job of it because they're cocking it up balls. But I do agree there does need to be some sort of um, legislation. But the way they're going about it is a bit fucked up, really. Two mil tanks and all that shit. You know. Uh, where are we? I'm trying to catch up with things. Yeah. Jamie, I'm not answering that one. <laughs> right, TGFM. It depends entirely on what sort of power you want. Also keep an eye out on the for sale pages because you'll get something a bit cheaper. A met mod. Um Are you good with are you alright with hybrids? Do you know your battery safety? Geek Vape Karma would be a nice bit of kit. And it comes with a dripper. Slash RDA. Sort of's the wrong answer. <laughs> Regulate it is then. If you say sort of when I say if you say you think you're alright with hybrids and you say sort of, then to me that says you're not. Yeah, the Geek Vape Karma is a nice fucking bit of kit. Um, someone's doing, yeah, someone's doing the E-Leafs, aren't they? Um, uh, the I-Stick, uh, there's the I-Stick 200 as well. You can pick them up for about uh, 20 quid. Yeah, Tesla Sig 3, that's a good one. That's a good bit of kit. Hey, Dolores. As long as you've got decent batteries, you'll be all right. But I mean, personally, I, I wouldn't go with the Mac mod. If you're not sure, get something regulated. Get a second-hand regulator. Pick yourself up a bloody RX200. Get yourself three batteries. RX200. RX200S. Pick them up for fucking peanuts. Three batteries and a charger. Job done. Get a six-bay charger and six batteries. You're laughing. you got 200 watts. 250 watts if you upgrade it. You know. You've got plenty of oomph if you need it. How much is an RS200, RX200S these days? I know I got mine for fucking dirt cheap. They're like 50 quid. 40, 50 quid. Gearbest, 200S. Yeah. What's that currently at the minute? £26. Yeah, UK e Sig store if I can have any clearance. Also check out um, Aspire, they're having a clearance as well. What, an RX 200S? Yeah, I've got an RX 200S here. Yeah. 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 
Hang on, is it on autofocus? No, it's not on autofocus. Focus, you bastard. Come on. Autofocus has been an absolute twat today. There you go. Takes three 18650s. They're £26.45 on um, thingy at the minute. Yeah, Elif I just S, 3000 more. Good good little mod. I've not had one myself. But I've heard good things. Count thirteen quid. Yeah, that that would. Yeah, I know that's cheap as chips, but that's not for super low owned builds. That Callius, it wouldn't be suitable for um, like anything under probably 0 0.6, 0 0.7 because it's an older tech. That's where I got the um, the one three four mini from. Oh, now it fucking focuses. Give it that. It'll focus on that. Yeah, focus on that stupid thing. We're a little over 15 minutes left, guys. We're a little under. Um, yeah, there's a lot of paper, uh, lots of places that are having chuckouts. Let's have a look. See what vaping 101 have got because they have some cheap stuff. See, I prefer a chunky mo mod. Have a look, see what they've got in the deals <coughs> on vaping 101 because they have some good stuff. I joined Limitless RDTA mechanical mod, comes in RDTA and everything, 30 quid. Uh, da -da -da, if you're not sure on mech mods, then go for something. What about a Pico Jewel? Mind you, that's chunky again, isn't it? Yeah, there's nothing exciting there, is Yeah, 30 quid, that's a bargain, that is, Vaping 101. It's a nice little mod, that. Alright Chris, not bad mate, how are you?
Right, what the fuck's going on with this fucking thing? X split is being an absolute thunder twonk. Alright, Chris, yeah, tonight I am on this bad boy, the iTaste 134 Mini, and I'm on this bad boy. It focuses. Yeah. And I'm on the Halicin. And it's all got the same juice in it. I've got Chubby Bubble Vapes. And I've got the. In that one, because it's 50 50 juice in there, I've got. Oh, Halicin Hazes. Oh, Gin's Addiction. That's bloody cheap, that is Callius. Bloody cheap. So has anyone uh, looking to has anyone um, bought anything or looking to buy anything this week then? Bugger off, Aries. <laughs> I can fucking hold the shelf on that. See? Fucking spot on. Absolutely fucking spot on. Bottom. See? Happy now? Yeah, no one's even fucking noticed what's sat there. Yes, I'm a geek. And I'm not sad to be a Trekkie, so I'm going to be a fucking red dwarfy. I'm going to be a dwarfer. Be a dwarfer, mate. The spirit level is correct. I bought it from a reputable place. Nice Dolores. Yeah, did you get anything else? Like, it doesn't have to be vape related. Is there anything else you've had um, come in or you're waiting for or whatever? Say, so I'm waiting for another camera to come. I also want to buy one of those Shimmy Flipsies. What else have I got? I've got something else coming. I've got something coming. I can't remember what it is, but I've got something coming. No, it's from Boundland. <laughs> I'm sure you'll have tons of fun with it before it decides it's going to fuck off and you'll never see it again. <laughs> Why don't you just buy a fucking one terabyte um, external drive that's cheaper than buying the one terabyte internals half the time? You'll get more bang for your buck. Let's see the other day. Is it four terabyte for eighty quid? In the case, me. <laughs> Sometimes it's cheaper to buy an external hard drive than it is uh, buy an internal one. That's what I do usually if I need a new external hard drive.
You can get some really good deals these days on externals. And what one terabyte externals fifty quid? Sometimes if you look hard enough, you'll find places that have got a three terabyte or a two terabyte cheaper. Some of them are dirt cheap. You can get a five terabyte external fucking hard drive for bloody hundred and thirty quid. Bought a pack of bourbon biscuits. Nice, nice. Nice. Yeah, that's what I do, Callius. Buy the externals cheaper. And they actually have half decent hard drives in them. Yeah, it's a lot of pack of biscuits, mate. A lot of pack of biscuits. <laughs> Because I find a lot of these external enclosures are shit that you buy. And it is sometimes cheaper to buy stuff ready done. Just look on fucking Maplins and places like that. Amazon. I found all sorts. I think the last time I bought a 2 terabyte hard drive it was about 38 quid. In an external, it came in an external. Yeah. Good drives in those, Callius. Yeah, because the PS4 drives were ridiculous prices, just because it had PlayStation written on it. Go for it, chicken. Go for it. Going on out there. Someone shouting the dog or something. But yeah, well, it's nearly time to fuck off, peeps. It's nearly time to bugger off. What was that? Looking stuff, doing stuff. Got stuff. Got stuff. Vape, vapor crew, ten thirty mils. Mm. We've got some fucking Billy bargains on emails, have we? Vape crew, ten thirty mil liquids, only thirty nine ninety nine. Meant to be one hundred and fifty pounds. So you get ten ten thirty mil bottles. Vapor crew, three and six milligram strengths. Normally have a retail of forty nine ninety nine per bottle, but you get ten bottles for just thirty nine ninety nine. Since you're on a gold member list, you can also use the exclusive fifteen percent off code. Down to thirty three ninety nine. Ooh. Specials are LS Cricket. They've got specials. Get over on to uh, eCigaspire.co.uk. Uh, they seem to have some Billy Bargains. eCigaspire. What was that? Fucking Vape Crew. Was it Vape? Vapor Crew. There they are. Vapor Crew. Vapor Crew. Vapor Crew. There you are, a box of 10 30 mils. There you are. There you go, guys. Check that shit out. Bloody hell, that is a bargain, Dolores. 3 terabyte for 120 Canadian. What's that in English? <laughs> Canadian dollars, 2 pounds. What did you say? 120 Canadian. 
120 Canadian. That's 72 quid in our money. That's an absolute bargain. Yeah, that's a bargain. That is a bit of a billy bargain, that. You try buying a 3 terabyte hard drive on its own. You're talking 90 quid just for the fucking hard drive? Definitely worth getting. Says you're having to buff, faff about with a hard drive in an enclosure then, doesn't it? And you've got like all that storage. Partition it up. And then sort of folders out on it. Because that's a bit of a billy billy, billy bargain. So it's worth it's worth it for that it's worth it that sort of price, but for the three terabyte, what make is it? It's worth having for that price. I think that's an absolute billy bargain. That absolute billy bargain. Absolute billy bargain. I've got a Seagate uh, 320 gig. It's old now, but that thing's built like a brick shit house. <laughs> it's one with the orange flashy light on the front. <laughs> Cracking bit of kit. Well, guys, it's time to me for buggering offings. Yes, it is. So, once again, thanks a lot for watching. Thanks for supporting me. I'll just get some uh, reviews back up soon. Hopefully, now I'm all sorted out. And we shall see you soon. See you next week. Six to eight. Same vape time. Same vape channel. Ta-da!